a practical test exercise on English words that we do not use in the plural. English words that we do not use in the plural. If you missed that video, please refer to that video before you come to this test exercise. And so, if you come to this, open the video, bring out your exercise book that you use for this particular channel, copy all the questions. When you copy all the questions, pause the video and try to provide the answers. From each of the brackets, you have from each of the brackets, you have two options. From each of the brackets, you have two options. Two options. From each of the brackets, you have two options. Underline the correct option from the bracket. And then come back to the video as we look at that together. Number one, Moses wants to purchase seven dozens Seven dozen chairs. What are we going to put there? Seven dozen chairs. We say, if the word dozen is not preceded by a number, by numeral, like 30, 40, 50, 1 million, 1,000, then dozen. But if it preceded by if it preceded by numeral, then you put dozens. If it's not, then you put dozens. So you can say, we want dozens of eggs. We want dozens of chairs. But if you have number three, you cannot say dozens. You say three dozen. Three dozen eggs. Or five dozen eggs. Or five dozen chairs. Brickamatan has 50,000 50, people. What are we going to put there? 50,000 people. 80 sheep. 80 sheep are grazing in the field. What are we going to put there? 80 sheep are grazing in the field. Number four. Many students have good knowledge. Good knowledge of economics and geography. What are we going to put there? Have good knowledge. Number five. Jide and Jude have, great, have made great progresses. Progress. What are we going to put there? Have made great progress. Look at number six. During the heavy rainfall, there were was thunders and lightning. Thunder and lightning. We are going to put that. We are going to take. During the heavy rain, there. Because we are talking of thunder and lightning, there was no thunder and lightning. There was thunder and lightning. Number seven. Several companies are now using the latest machinery machineries. What are we going to put there? Are now using the latest machinery. Number eight. Politics is are uh, not for the chicken hearted. What are we going to put there? Politics is not for the chicken hearted. Number nine, all the students' money is are kept in the bank. What are we going to put there? Is kept in the bank. Look at number ten. We left all the companies' money monies in the bank. What are we going to put there? All the companies' money in the bank. Number eleven, Agnes and Antonia are glad that the news is uh, good. What are we going to put the news? Is good. The news is good. And so, those are the answers for the questions as you see them on the board. Let us go through the answers together with the sentences. Moses wants to purchase seven dozen chairs. Brickamatan has 50,000 people. 80 sheep are grazing in the field. Many students have good knowledge of economics and geography. And geography. Jide and Jude have made great progress. During the heavy rainfall, there was thunder and lightning. Number seven. Several companies are now using the latest machinery. 
machinery. Politics is not for the chicken hearted. All the students' money is kept in the bank. We left all the company's money in the bank. Agnes and Antonia are glad that the news is good. That the news is good. And so that is that for the answers that we have concerning English words that do not that we do not use in the plural. If you like our video, please share, subscribe and give us a thumbs up.